In this video, you will learn how to tune your guitar the easiest way possible. So let's dive in. My name is Stephen Murphy. I'm the co-founder of the Murphy School of Music here in Chester. And in this channel, we provide tutorials on all things to do with music. Today, we are looking at how to tune your guitar. Now, there are many ways that you can do this. You can tune by ear if you have perfect pitch, but most people, that's not the case. So you can tune off another instrument, just make sure that instrument is in tune, or you can use a device like a guitar tuner or even a tuner app. And that's what we're going to do today. We're going to use a guitar tuner app to tune our guitar. Now, the first thing that we need to know is what the strings should be. So the string names should be from top to bottom, E, A, D, G, B, E. Now there are little sayings we can use to help us remember that. One I always use, Eddie ate dynamite, goodbye Eddie. The first letter of every word being the name of the string. So we need to know that first. Once we know that, now we can tune the string to the note that it should be. So we're gonna get our app. I've already downloaded it on mine. I am using the Fender Tune app, which is a free app available on iOS and Android as well. So once you download your app, if we look at the main screen, we have several different options here. All we need to do is select Auto. Once we've selected that, we can see the names of the strings are actually already at the bottom. E, A, D, G, B, E. So they're the six strings of our guitar that we want to tune to. So if we start with the first one, what we're going to do, we're going to pluck our guitar string. And as we can see, it's not quite an E at the moment. It's actually, as it says, too low. So what we need to do is we need to pluck our string and then turn our tuning head anti-clockwise until we hit the desired note. This time we've gone too sharp, so we're gonna tune down. Okay, now as you can see, the circle turns green as it moves into place. And as we hold it there, it will then turn a darker shade of green to confirm it is actually in tune. Now, if we do the same with the next string, A, this time we can see it's actually too sharp. What we're gonna do is turn our tuning head clockwise this time. And as it comes down in pitch, again, the circle moves closer to the gray circle. And as we get there, again, it turns green. and then to a dark shade of green when it's fully in tune. Again, we're gonna to move to our next string. This should be a D, but let's pluck it. So again, it's too flat, so we're gonna tune up. So we're gonna turn our tuning head anti-clockwise until it becomes the desired note. Now, as you can see with this one, it's quite far out of tune which means actually is a different note. There we go, we're nearly there. And now we're in tune. Okay, now we're gonna to move to the next string, but opposite side. Make sure when you're tuning, you are following the string and tuning the correct, or turning the correct tuning head. It's very easy to get the wrong one, and then you've put the string out of tuning that you've just tuned. So again, too sharp, so we need to tune down, meaning we're gonna turn anti-clockwise until it reaches the desired note. Okay. I'm gonna repeat the process for the last two strings. And 
And there we go. Our guitar is now in tune. Now, guitars go out of tune very easy. Chances are you will need to tune your guitar every time you pick it up. Unlike other instruments like a piano, which will stay in tune for months at a time. So using the sayings, Eddie ate dynamite, goodbye Eddie, we can learn the notes the strings should be. And by turning the tuning heads clockwise or anti-clockwise, depending on if they need to go up in pitch or down in pitch. Now you need to just check with that, that your strings are actually wound the correct way. They may be round the other way on the guitar, which means you just need to turn the tuning head the opposite direction to go up or down in pitch. Pluck your string and turn it and listen to which direction the note goes. Does it go up in pitch or does it go down in pitch? That way you know which way you need to turn for the rest of the, the tuning process. Using apps like this is a really easy way to get tuned up straight away and then you can start playing. We hope you've learned something from this tutorial today. Please do hit the subscribe button and the notification button and then you'll be notified when we do release more tutorials to do with guitar or other aspects of music. Now you've tuned your instrument, why not check out our next video, how to read tabs for the guitar to start playing straight away. Keep up with the practice and we'll see you soon.